Ideas are the easy part about making art. In essence, ideas are cheap. Let's talk about it. Wait, how can that be true? Aren't there some ideas that are so amazing that they carry their own weight, lead to massive innovations in our world? Wasn't the internet just an idea at one point? The car? The plane? Well, yeah, of course. But the idea alone did little other than acknowledge the potential. The thing could not exist without the idea. But the idea is, in most cases, simply the starting point. Likewise, when it comes to artwork, regardless of what you are trying to pursue, the ideas are simply the catalyst that gets you moving in the right direction. It's the hard work afterward that leads to something being accomplished. Ideas are wonderful, but they are far more akin to matches than actual fire. They are the inspiration, in some cases the trigger that allows you to start the fire, but if that is all they are, well, no one is going to harm their house or be dazzled by a single match that burns for a few seconds before it goes out. Your ideas are important, sure, but they are far less important than that which comes afterward. The work. In most cases, honestly, the work is not only more valuable than the idea, but is the thing solely responsible for any product at all. Consider how often you have had a wonderful idea, begun to work on the project, and then shifted things significantly because once you actually delve into the execution, you realize you had some preconceived notions, and maybe your idea doesn't actually hold water. In this way, the work is almost entirely the only thing that matters. In a perfect world, you would have a great idea and follow it up with substantial work to achieve something amazing. But if you are waiting around for the perfect idea to occur to you, I would encourage you to simply start moving. Start drawing, start painting, start sculpting, anything that is enjoyable to you, even if your idea is non-existent or lackluster in your eyes. Chances are, as you start to actually do the work, ideas will make themselves known to you. And even more likely, if you stop putting so much pressure on your ideas to be amazing, more good ones might just find their way out of the crevices in your mind and say, hello, here I am. In short, ideas are cheap. They're easy to come by. They're easy to find on their own. But by themselves, they really amount to almost nothing. Good ideas followed by good work will amount to good things. As always, Thank you for listening. I hope that this was beneficial for you and I hope that you are ready to dive into a wonderful week of creative activities. Have a good one, y'all. See you soon.